if you're somebody that really enjoys helping people, health sciences might be the field for you. So I'm here with Deanna Steneford, and today I'm actually gonna be her dental assistant. So Deanna, what exactly do you have in store for us today? Wanika, well, normally we start all of our students in the, the skills lab here, and you get to work on mannequins and really learn your skills, but today we're gonna take you right to the dental clinic, and you are gonna see how it is to function as a dental assistant on the dental clinic floor. Awesome, let's put on some scrubs. Hi, my name is Nico. I'm going to be your dental assistant today, and you must be Sarah Lovelow. It's Lovelow, that's okay. Ah, so I'll just call you Sarah. <laughs> that's fine. So the dentist will be with you shortly. After a bit of a shaky start, I quickly settled into my role during a short procedure. My main responsibility was to work chair-side with the dentist and provide necessary assistance during treatments. Outside of chair duties, dental assistants are also responsible for communicating with patients and preparing them to see the dentist, keeping them calm during treatments and exams, and accessing their dental records. So that was a really cool experience, helping out patients with you, Deanna. How did I do? Nika, you did pretty good for your first time. I know sometimes it can be challenging getting patients and their names right and everything, but you did a good job, and I can tell you're a caring individual. So you think I have what it takes to be a dental assistant? I think you do. If you're interested in the dental assisting field, there's plenty of different options, too. You can do chair side, you can do front desk management. We have degrees in that, and we have our certificate in dental assisting. So I think you have what it takes to be in the field of dentistry. Well, thank you so much for your time, Deanna, and let's see what's next.